I got my first fly rod when I was 13 uh, in Colorado at a Walmart, actually. Yeah, it cost me 25 bucks. I was on my way to a Boy Scout camp, um, and my scout master was a big fly fisherman. And my mother gave me $100 just to make me last for the two weeks while I was in Colorado. So, me being the kid I was, I took that money and blew it the first chance I got it. So, I bought a fly rod. Uh, didn't know what in the hell to do with it. But that's, that's kind of when I started. But I loved it. I, I remember I loved these, the aspect of fly fishing. When I got discharged from the military, uh, I remember sitting in my apartment. I was just sitting there thinking, and my girlfriend told me, we need to find something to do, something that you really enjoy doing. And the first thing that came to my mind was fly fishing. I really loved doing it. So I looked on the internet, looked around fly fishing. You know, I actually, I don't know why, something provoked me to type in fly fishing for veterans, and Project Young Water showed up. And um, that's seriously how it basically got started, just me being um, kind of in the depressed state that I was in and then Project Healing Waters kind of found me and it's been different ever since, so. Uh, it's basically one of the first things that Phil Johnson had me start doing uh, was time flies. I'm actually addicted to it now. I can't stop doing it. I, I tie flies more than I study while I'm in class, so uh, kind of counterproductive, but I thoroughly enjoy it. Fly fishing, one thing it's done for me, it, it's really helped me calm down. So it, it, I, I think overall, fly fishing has made me a better person. It has allowed me to. Uh, become more relaxed and it honestly keeps me out of trouble, I'll tell you the truth. Yeah.